All right, so we'll get another review. This is a, the, uh, the Fiacci Green Laser sight. It's also got a flashlight uh, built into it. Picked this up on Amazon. I think it's around 35 bucks, something like that. I probably should start getting these prices down before I make a video, but anyway. Um, I'll put a, a link in the description below. We'll check it out first, see what we think about it. The box seems pretty nice. It's like very American. They got an eagle on there and like some cowboys holding eagles, which that's, hey, that's pretty American. I don't know what, how much more you get, but uh, anyway. All right, so let's open this up, see what we got. Check out the packaging, and what is this? We got a key for a 2014 Santa Fe. Maybe that's like a free giveaway when you order this. I don't know. I'll throw this, put that aside. Maybe I need to send this back to Amazon. They probably didn't mean to put it in here. All right, so we got, looks like a charger and a battery, Allen wrench. Let's see what else. Flashlight with a ring. All right, so here's the rail clip, the Picatinny. Uh, rail portion of it and I'm assuming this would slide you know in there somehow all right so we got that let's set these two aside here's a uh, okay here's a battery charger oh what am I talking about with this this is for uh, like a overseas shoot it's a little changer for the regular 120 volt 60 Hertz power like we have or 60 um, yeah frequency 60 here it's different in other countries I don't know how to open this, I guess. I just have to tear it open, but anyway, there's that. If you're in another country that uses this, and I'm not sure which country that is. Plug that in one of these ways. Yep, like that. There you go. Alright, so it's versatile. A couple different places there. What else we got? We got a battery. And it looks like it would be a remote. Yeah, it looks like a remote uh, button for this. Yep, that's what it is. Be honest with you, this looks waterproof too, so that's pretty good. All right, we'll set that aside. Looks like a screw here. Probably help us install that on the rail. All right, so I got it mounted on this uh, this handgun. I uh, can't quite hold my arm far enough away with a full-size rifle, so I decided to do it with this pistol instead. I'll just give you an idea what it looks like. It's going to be the same thing. It's really tight fitting on a pistol. I don't think you would necessarily need a laser this size on a pistol, but this is just to show you the rail. Rails are accurate, you know, size and everything. Uh, this is just like an air pistol, so anyway. But the rails are the same as the ones that are on the actual, like the like an M16 or like even like an AR-22. They're all the same size rails, so. All right, so here we are with that. Um, you can see now this actually lines up pretty well for the flashlight. So you can see the flashlight. It's not the brightest flashlight. But um, the laser is like unreal, right? So, all right, so here's the laser. The buttons are in the back. Uh, right here is that, and I mean, it is really bright. Um, you know, it, it's, it's bright, so that's all I can say about that. It's got some adjustments here, uh, you know, left and right. You take these caps off, and then you can adjust it, just like you would a scope. Uh, same thing, you click that back off. Uh, we'll check out that remote button real quick. There's the flashlight again. So you can see the way it looks. Uh, it's a pretty nice looking setup. It's a sight module, armed forces, laser sight, all that. So, all right, we'll check that out with the remote button. All right, so here's the uh, the remote uh, button on it. Like, pardon the ridiculousness of this. I know you would never use this on a pistol, but uh, I'm just trying to just trying to demonstrate, you know, how this works. You could put this, you know, really anywhere you wanted. It's a really easy, you know, it's a, a monetary button, so it's not like a you gotta release it so you know my thought is that you would probably take this you know somewhere you know where you could click it without really you know interfering with what you're doing so if you just put it somewhere I mean it's really easy to push so you know you could just set it to where when you picked it up on your rifle you know it could be somewhere near the stock somewhere you're already going to be making pressure with it or you know making contact so anyway but there it is you know really just want to demonstrate the way this uh, laser works and the way the flashlight works just kind of give you an idea it does fit on the rail and you know how it looks how much room you're needing not for a pistol for sure but uh, for a, uh, a rifle yeah I definitely think it would work for you um, seems to be pretty well made seems durable batteries uh, it's got a couple batteries in it you know charging case and everything so really you'll be set up it even comes with the allen wrench uh, you know with the shorter side on it to get in some of these tighter spots so uh, it's pretty good if you're interested uh, like I said earlier there'll be a link below and uh, you can check that out there so thanks for watching